Portland Sea Dogs. Ugh. Now, technically, I don't really hate the Portland Sea Dogs, but you gotta remember, the Sea Dogs are a minor league team from from the Red Sox. So technically, ugh. Ha! Tu! I spit on you. Remember to subscribe and hit that bell icon for more videos from me, more videos of any of this show 19, and also make sure to like this video. So it really means a lot. So the question of the day is, how's your day doing? Are you doing well? What uh, what plans do you have for the week? Let me know in the comment section down below. So you know what we gotta do, we just gotta make sure that we increase that uh, cap, or maybe not, maybe we'll work on something else. Maybe we could work on, let's see, durability, batting clutch, plate discipline, let's work on this, <coughs> let's work on the sign, let's see what the results are. And I get some points in there. Not bad. Now, it's time to start the game, or maybe not. We're gonna begin to look at you as a third baseman for a short time. Getting a few reps on your position can hurt. It could take a few games for you to settle in, of course. Just give it a try for a couple of weeks. Try to have fun with it. I'll give it my all, coach. So I like the attitude. Not everyone would take this news so well. Thanks, coach. I'm trying to help this team win it in any way I can. Alright, so, um, let's talk to Damon Odom, the catcher. Check in with Odom about his recent home run drought. You're a good ball player. Wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't. You'll check the slump soon. Odom says he hopes so. Alright, so you know just gotta make sure that we let him know that he's a he's a great ball player. So we're batting four hundred. Uh, 18 runs, 38 hits, 6 RBIs, 13 stolen bases. Is it good enough to go to AAA? I'm not sure. I'm not the manager, so I cannot really say. But anyways, let's play against the Sea Dogs. Yeah, yeah, the Sea Dogs. Oh, why? Why do you have to be? A a team affiliated with the Red Sox. Why? Chance Adams in the mound, five and one. Anyways, let's get right down to it. Those are my stats. Batting 400, 441 on base percentage. Having a good year. That's right. <laughs> I'm tired. You wanted to pay the pitch. Ball. So, it, I'm not sure I'm not sure if you noticed, but I have a slugging percentage over 500 despite the fact that I have no home runs whatsoever. So, basically, I'm finding different ways to get that number up. Getting a few doubles, a few triples. You know how it goes. So far, no home runs. I don't have that pop in my bat yet. Foul! That dreaded foul ball. Span. And heck is span. In the pitch. I mean, that's a nice cutter. Gotta admit that. Fooled me for for a while. Looked like it was gonna get out of the zone, but then it it swooped back in. A nice way to throw a cutter. Not as much movement as a slider, but it's actually a bit more potent due to the speed of the cutter. 
So it's, it's like a fastball and a slider. Except you give a little bit of that speed of the fastball for that movement of the cut of the cutter, which technically makes it a little bit more potent. Speed with a little bit of zing on it. Ball is one. And the pitch strikes. Nope. Ball two. Bird. No. Oh. Oh, he was just the right person at the right time. Dang it. Foul! Dang it. The one up in the pitch. Hey, yes sir, base hit. Let's go. I'm one for three so far. Let's see. Dog for Benita zigs into the plate. Come on. Run, mate. In time. Stolen base. Let's go. Make, make, making it 14 for the year. Slide, baby. Safe. Moving the third on that one. Now all you gotta do, Greg, is just drive the ball out there in the outfield. Just make sure I, I have some time. And I get a run. Make it a fun nothing. Alright, good enough for me. Run, Mike! Throw off bounce doesn't matter. Five nothing. Now I'm batting one for three for this one. And man, we're doing business right now. <laughs> the umpire really must be in our favor because I think I broke the plane on that one. Come on, yes sir, that's going to be at least a double. Oops. Yeah, stay on second. Eight to nothing. Give me some more points when it comes to power, speed, and contact. A nice place to put the ball, but at the same time, oops. Horror. You bum. Damn it. Now I'm batting 404 for the for the night. We're at the bottom of the eight with one out. We've been doing business. Right. Just wanted to be patient at the plate, you know, not try to do too much. How to get my pitch. Why the hell did this swing at that? Man, man, it had to be a C dog. It had to be a double A Red Sox. Damn it! Batting two for five, so <laughs> technically I say 400. Luis Velasco digs into the plate. And here we go for the final out. And here's the bunt. The throw. In time. Game over. We get the word, baby.
the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Chance Adams earns his sixth winning So yeah, we get the win there. Let's play the next one. And I, and I get a few bonuses here and there. Helping to the cause. Now I'm batting 400 with a 439 on base percentage, 520 slugging percentage, and 14 stolen bases. And we're off to a bad start, one to nothing. Portland, damn it. Ball of one, ball one. Throw it. Dang, name it. Dang, name it. Those throwing motions when it comes from down low, it really, it really, it really disturbs my timing. It throws my timing off. Damn it, he had to jog, man. That hurts. Ezra Chassin digs into the plate. I'm pitching sucks. <laughs> Nope. Easy out. Nice throw to first. Now I'm batting 396. Vance runner with a. Uh, okay, Vance runner without recording now. Alright. God damn it, you're third. Close. I did advance the runner, but I, it wasn't out, so I can't really play me on that one. A good slide on his part. Too early, I agree. Foul. Oh and two. Nope. And that's gonna be a foul. No one and two. Uh, please. Oh. Oh for three. And all of a sudden we've taken a jump. We have the lead. Not a bad jump. Not the best hit right there, but it's a blooper and a base hit. Loader alert. I mean, not the best hit. I, I hit it out of the zone, but hey, it lands for a base hit. And at the end of the day, that's what counts. Doesn't matter if, uh, how the hit happened. Like, come on, you jerk. You just didn't even let me finish my sentence. And so I was saying, it doesn't matter how the hit happens. It still counts on the score. You jerk. Can't you just, can't you just let me finish my sentence first? I might get caught. Throw off. Uh, throw off target. I caught lucky break there. I actually thought I was gonna get caught. That that pitch was so fast, man. It wasn't even funny. You know, delivered it at the very least. Just to be safe. All right. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna steal it just to make sure I, I'm not the victim of an out on third base. All 
All right, so that's the end of the inning. That doesn't show the inning, my inning progression. Here comes Doug McDonald. All right, so this one's going to be an out. Out. Very easy. We get the win, baby. Don't let the Sea Dogs win. They're not allowed to. And here comes Domingo Acevedo, who has had a rough start to the season. And I do better at home than on the road. I guess I like the support from the home crowd. The one up in the pitch. Come on, man. Oh. He barely even had to move for that one. That sucks. Dang it. Cyrus Sims digs into the pace. And that one's going to be an easy out. An easy out. Um, yeah. You're out. Let's celebrate. Craig Fulton digs into the plate. Hey, yo. Easy throw to first. And that will end at the end, or at least at the Tarth side. Now I'm batting 390. Now I just realized I have a pink bat. Come on, yes! With speed I have that, the speed I have that's at least a double. Because I'm dead, the one got the triple. Oh, wow! Triple! Man! Two run triple, and add some more points to that slugging percentage. Zero home runs, he had a uh, slugging percentage over 500. Doesn't make sense. In the pitch. And that will end the inning, sadly. At least I got two RBIs. Sam Travis digs into the plate. He's one for one. It's time for some double play action. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Bruh. Why? What just why? And now I'm swinging at things. Base it. That's at least a double. I have five doubles in this one. So five doubles in this season. So, yeah. I'm tearing the cover off the ball. Yes, sir. Run, Mike. Cut the deficit. Fly, baby. Safe. Now I'm batting two for three. 
and it's a tie game. Batting two for three on this one. And that's a foul. And the pitch. It's a little dribbler. Well, for an out. All right. Oh man. Batting 398. Drive in the winning run. Be the reason your team leaves the field to win. I'm batting two for four. Time for some clutch hitting. I hit the X button, but luckily it didn't swing. That would have been bad. Oh, foul ball, man. These moments are intense. I'm not going to lie. I'm so desperate, but honestly, not a bad pitch of swing, I just a bit early. I'm going to take a risk here and guess he's going to throw inside corner low. And I was wrong there. I hope, yep, that's a foul ball. I was wrong that time. This is the reason why I really don't guess pitches on Hall of Fame. It's risky. Nope, safe, 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 safe. Thank you. Really needed that one. And another safe. So, full count, I guess. So, it's either get a base hit, get a walk, or strike myself out. And with that, game is over. Walk off win. Walk off single. We get the big win, baby. And everybody's congratulating me. A fantastic at bat there. I made him work the count. I made him work the count. Get some pitches there. Got the pitch I wanted. And basically, once that ball was past the infield, it was all she wrote. And here I am, being <laughs> getting interviewed. This thing has been going on for a few years now. This. <coughs> Uh, this scene started out on uh, MLB 13 and Sean, remember? 3 for 5, 1 run, 1 double, and <coughs> 3 RBIs. Was it, wasn't there a triple in the mix? But yeah. Basically, that's exactly what we needed to end this game. He told me I needed to get something going, and I did just that. See, that was the one that got me a triple. So, yeah. OPS of, of 1,800 in that game. And that's the end of that series. I did pretty well, I'm not gonna lie. So, 3 for 5 with a triple and a double. I did pretty well for myself. Got plus one on contact versus righties, plus one on power versus righties, plus two on batting clutch. On fielding, I actually went down a bit because oh, plus two on contact. Okay, my bad. But anyways, yeah. Uh, Jose, you turned it to you. Jose, you turned in quite a performance in this game. The fans were chanting your name. What's it like hearing that? I'm just happy they know what my name is. They certainly do now, Jose. You got their attention. I gotta admit, it does feel good. I love the fans. Great game, Jose. Keep it up. Alright, so... Uh, so, I'm doing pretty well for myself. My first game was as a third baseman. Certainly had a nice touch to it. Still the number one hitter in the Eastern League. 
and and even in the entire double A. So I'm certainly doing my thing. Uh, so basically, let's okay, can you check on? No, you cannot check on. Uh, anyways, uh, so OPS, I am number one in OPS with 981. So just to get to consideration, the other guys in the top 10 have at least one home run. I am number one and I don't have a squad of a home run. Oh man, that's funny. Really funny, but uh, my starting percentage is at 541. And again, the other guys in the top 10 have at least one home run. I am number one by about 27 points, and I don't have a home run to my name. And basically, uh, yeah, my. I mean, the other guys have at least like 50 points added. I mean, you know, add batting average plus at least 50 points to the on base percentage. And I'm here, like, I don't have that many walks, and I'm number one on on base percentage. So, you know, I've been doing my thing. And I'm number one, sorry, no, I'm, not, I'm number three in stolen bases. I want to look at the RBI total, and I'm just I'm just barely scratching by. Tied at 46 with 11 RBIs. Last game was a great one for me. It really added uh, it added some boost to my numbers. And now that I'm a third baseman, at least for the time being, I want to check the player comparisons. Who am I being compared to? So yeah, we have, we have Henry Allard, a third, uh, sorry, a third baseman, Triple A starter, 20 to 22 years of age, B potential, 65 overall, and then there's Miguel Andujar, who, who is actually who is a B potential, 78 overall. So yeah, I guess I'm doing well. I mean. Maybe soon I will get that call to AAA at least to to get off the bench and do something. But overall, these stats I'm doing all right, and I hope that continues on later on. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe and hit that bell icon. Like this video and let me know how your day is going in the comment section down below. See you soon.